Hey everyone, welcome back to a daily deal here on Amore Fabrics. If you're new here, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe. This is a crafty channel for things for your crafty projects um, and uh, it's usually shop shares and things like that. So I hope you subscribe and follow along here. Today is a daily deal. I haven't done a daily deal in quite some time, but usually when I do a daily deal, they're packed, they're filled with a bunch of goodies and it's a great bargain. Um, they usually sell out fast. So if you see something here, um, you might just want to go straight to the link down below. This is a drop down menu. You get a choice of book covers. So I'm going to show you before I even jump right into the pack today. You get to choose any of the book covers I'm going to show you. They're all beautiful 1800s, early 1900s books. I kept the spines intact for you guys um, as well. I'm going to go over all the books first. Um, but when you go to the listing, there's a drop down menu. Click on that listing um, and it'll take you straight directly to that listing. And in that listing, it's going to give you choice of your book cover. The books will be numbered. There'll be a picture with a number on the book for you guys. And um, so you know, okay, that's the book I wanted. And you can put that in your cart and grow it while you can. Another good, good thing about the daily deal today too, it is free shipping. Yes, I'm going to cover your shipping. I know that's one of the biggest things that irks me is having to pay shipping, especially when this pack here today is going to be over two pounds. So the daily deal today is going to be $26 free shipping, which great. I mean, you're getting this pack under $20 and you're going to see how awesome it is. And what I did was the reason why I did this is because all these books are so very popular and um, I could have sold the books outright, but um, I figured why not could I, you know, for my customers, I can give them a bit of each and not just a bit. Most of these books, you got between three to 10 pages of each book, um, which was amazing. Now, just the ephemera in this package is over 150 pieces and they're all beautiful pages. You guys will not be disappointed. That's not including the extra goodies I'm going to show you today as well. Um, but just the ephemera itself, it's 150 plus. I lost count after 150. <laughs> so um, I hope you guys jump on this way you can. Like I said, they sell out fast. But I'm going to show you the biggest theme of this is vintage um, garden, floral. Um, the biggest thing of it, uh, what really inspired me was um, Alice in the Wonderland. I know it is so hard to find Alice in the Wonderland stuff and usually it's pretty expensive. And in this pack, you're getting um, 12 pages. And I'm gonna, I can't wait to show you guys the pages of Alice in the Wonderland in your guys' pack. Of course, each page is different, but I, I promise you they're absolutely gorgeous. And I can't wait to share with you guys the books that are in this pack. Like I said, any of the books I'm showing you today are going to be up for grabs and you're going to love them. I don't know if you guys follow along and watched my giving tree um, choice, but um, that is part of the same books as the music hour books, the green cover, totally uh, vintage, just gorgeous. All right, guys. So I'm going to put the paper pack aside and then, like I said, just the paper pack itself. Look at that. I've already separated them um, in sections for you. So when I did the assembly line, um, they are already divided and, and stuff like that. So I can't wait to dig in guys. But let me quickly first start with the Alice in the Wonderland books that I use. Again, any of the book covers I'm showing you are gonna be up for grabs. You get to choose a book cover for your pack. One book cover, um, or if you get more than one pack, like I said, free shipping. So if you buy more than one pack, I'm covering your shipping. <laughs> so that is a pretty good deal. Um, especially, like I said, it weighs over two pounds. And of course, United States guys, I can't do international, but um, these are uh, vintage Alice in a Wonderland books. One was the Alice Avengers in a Wonderland and the other one is through the looking glass. They will be marked. Um, but look at beautifully intact, perfect size for journaling. Got like a, it's so cute. It's just gorgeous. I don't know if I can show you guys, but this, I have all the packs complete guys. So when you order today, it ships out today. There's no waiting a week for this um, junk journal kit. I was really on top of it this time. The only thing I didn't put in there is pages from this book. Cause I wanted to show you guys what inspired me for this kit was this book. 
and I have to put two pages of each in your guys' kit. I only can get two in each kit, but I wanted you guys to see the pages. No matter which page um, I go to, oh my God, guys, someone told me I should scan this. Well, hey, you guys can scan it, but no matter which page you get, and if you fold it in half, you're going to get beautiful photos. I mean, I'm just going to take my time on this because I'm telling you, I had a friend, she's like, you should keep it. And I'm like, what am I going to keep it for? I'd rather give each and every you guys a chance to have pieces um, that are totally, everything in this kit is 100% vintage. There's nothing new. This is all, like I said, late um, 1800s and early 1900s. All I think the, the latest I have is something in the 60s. But other than that, everything else is quite vintage and most likely scannable if you want to. But you guys, I'm telling you, <laughs> no matter what, look how colorful. I hope I got you guys in a frame. I'm not even looking at my computer. I'm just looking at the book. It's just gorgeous. I mean, and it's made in, and the cover is up for grabs. It's a pretty good size, but look how gorgeous it is. It's just beautiful. Light glare there, guys. Oh my God, just look at this page. Even if you fold that in half, Alice in the Wonderland, it's gorgeous. So it's by Dual Salone and Pierce, and this book was so expensive. It was like, when I looked up the price for it, it was like a hundred and something dollars. So some people were like, why in the world are you ripping it? Well, yes, I could have put this on the market, and yes, I could have got more money, but I wanted this kit to be perfect. So you guys all have a piece of it, but it's made in Italy um, and uh, by Salone and Pierce. It's just gorgeous, guys. It's just no matter what page, it's gorgeous. And you guys are going to get two pages of this. And like I said, every page has pictures. So I had to not rip that yet until I showed you guys. But um, so there's that. There's 25 covers and there's only 25 kits, guys. So once they're gone, they're gone. So I have the music hour. Let's see if you can see that. Isn't that gorgeous? Perfect size again, guys. Again, I all the books, I kept the spines in case you want to uh, tie them in. There's another music hour, the fourth book. I wonder if the insides are like that. All right. And then the children's readers here are like a deep navy blue. And what's cool is I did keep all the books. I kept the first original pages. So if you get this book, you will get these pages in it. This is from the 20s. But isn't that gorgeous? And I won't be this slow for it all because there's so much I want to show you. And I want this video to be short enough to where I can upload it fast. This one here says take trips to take. Look how gorgeous. Again. And I should speed it up here because I have a whole lot of books to show you. There's 25. So there's that one. All right, all right, there's this one here. It's really cool. The Children's Method Reader, love this. Look at the inside pages, guys, and you get a whole bunch of the original pages. This is the 30s. Isn't that gorgeous? It's the back. Of course, we got the Alice. This is gonna free up space for me and my countertop. All right, look at this. Look how grungy Victorian that is. It's called, it says Children's Praise embossed look how gorgeous I don't think you guys are going to go wrong with any of them so this one says international praise look at the back of that perfect size here's a hymnal I think it got a little worn there but this is gorgeous and I imagine you can do something at the top if you really wanted to it's beautiful huh and there's two of these I know that they're red I could totally see Christmas can't you guys? Perfect size, perfect red. There's two of those. Um, the practice and problem of problems of arithmetic. This is like an orangeyish color, but it's gorgeous, and it's got a lot of nice pages on the inside there too. I left for you. Progress and spelling. It's a green one. Again, left the pages here and there for you guys. I do have, oh my God, just wait. <laughs> I make it quick. I make it quick. We got the picture book. It's quite big, but look how gorgeous. I've seen where you guys made some nice size journals. There's the spine. I kept it in there just in case. 
these pages. Oh yes, there is pages. See in there. There's that one. All right, guys, I'll speed it up. This is actually rather cool. If you guys can see it, it says Humpty Dumpty. It's got Alice in the Wonderland. These are um, bedtime stories, literature stories. And inside, look at this. Look at that old tape, guys. So I can look at the inside pages. Isn't that gorgeous? All right. So you get those in there. Then you get the picture dictionary for children, which is another beautiful one. And I look at the inside. And again, like I said, when you, if you choose this book cover, you get, look at those beautiful pages. I could have kept them. Yes, I could have. <laughs> They're gorgeous, aren't they? And then there's two 365 bedtime stories. Again, I kept the original spine just in case you never know. Here's the inside. It's this one here. Look at the inside of that one. Left all the pages. This is so retro. Better speech and better reading. How cool is that, huh? Uh, what else do we got? My goodness, we're getting there. Oh, oh yes. And then we have Wonders of Nature, and I have more. So at least you guys got a head start on seeing what all you're going to get. Oh my gosh, just the paper here. All right, so this is what you guys are actually going to get in this kit, including the choice of your book cover which is awesome. I didn't not, I haven't shown you the other goodies yet here. I'm just going to start with the ephemera. Oh, sorry. And there's more. This is going to be at the bottom, but oh my God, I can't wait. All right. So this is at the way bottom. Just this itself. Let me get my scale. Not counting the book cover is so much paper guys. And you're not going to regret it. I promise. This is one pound, nearly six ounces, one pound, six ounces. Isn't that ridiculous? <laughs> See, when I make kits like this, that's why a daily deal is a daily deal. Um, it's just great price and um, you cannot beat what all I throw in it. So, okay, like I said, let's start with Alice in the Wonderland and I'm gonna fold it that way so then I don't lose my track. You're gonna get 10 or 12 pieces. I know it's 10 at least. Um, and this is, this is the first pack. So if you do purchase one today and you love exactly the pack I'm showing you, the first person to purchase and, and request it, I will go ahead and put this as your pack kind of thing. Just message me. Again, like I said, I mean, you could totally, when you fold pages, which I'm not going to fold it, it's like, no matter which side, it's going to be gorgeous, colorful. Oh yes. I forgot about this. I don't know how close I am. Let me check my camera really quick. I'm going to do a quick pause because then I have to enter a code on my computer. Let's see here. So I can kind of see where I'm at. Okay. That's more like it. Now I can get this back into frame. So, okay. And then here's from those other books, the smaller books. They're going to be black and white. But look how gorgeous. Cannot, cannot beat it, I promise you. A lot of beautiful pages in this Alice in a Wonderland pack, which is so cool, is that I put in these cute recipe cards, recipe papers, I'm sorry, but the cute mushrooms, look how cute. Could you totally see that in an Alice in a Wonderland or a garden theme? All right, there's this one here. This is larger, again, black and white, but just gorgeous. Go wrong. Oops, I didn't flip the page. There she is big. So it looks like I do have at least 10. How cool, huh, guys? All right, and in this pack as well, I had my notes, but oh well. You're going to get um, 20 music papers, all those different kind of hymnal music books that are gorgeous over there that you get to choose from. There, you get a 20 pack and they're all different sizes. Exactly what you see is the same assembly line. Of course, it might be a different kind of music, but uh, again, 1800s to um, early 1900s. So how cute, huh? Some at pictures. Well, for every pack, you'll have some kind of pictures in yours. Look how already aged. I'm loving the variety pack. I wanted to be able to, I mean, 20 pages. 20 pages of music into your pack is a great deal, especially if you're looking to stock up for a variety of pages. 
um, cannot be in it, you know? Isn't that gorgeous? All right. Here's the larger sizes. I, I skipped a bunch, <laughs> but I wanted to give you guys the larger sizes to kind of have an idea. So I, wall I went all the way up to like the, the, the 10 by 12s. All right. Okay, this is the Wonders of the World book that you see over there. Um, I think there's 10 pages, but again, they're very colorful, just like you see here. All different sizes of the peacock. Butterflies, the wonders of the world, uh, wonders of nature, and the wonders of the world are just gorgeous books, reading books, um, educational books for children. Pink flamingo, that reminds me of Betty, and a few other people. Okay, this here is the picture dictionary book that you guys seen earlier, and I think you get. I should have made notes. I think it's ten pages. And I, I will not be sending your package with. Uh, paper clips because one it weighs two I don't like how sometimes it'll try to dig into your um, papers so but look how gorgeous guys these are rather large great for folding and it's a lot guys I mean there's a whole lot you're getting in this pack again beautiful highly sought after pieces which you're gonna see here oh my god all the child readers and stuff God, you get so much. I was pretty impressed. What I did is I took a book. I only wanted to make 25 packs. Look how I'm just going to talk and turn pages for you guys. And so what I did is I took a book and I divided the pages for 25 packs. And that's how many pages you got in a pack. So what you see here exactly, like I said, is how many you get and what it's going to look like. Of course, every page is different. But again, I gave you guys the best example right now. Isn't that gorgeous? Speed it up here. So you guys get a bit of everything. I sound redundant, but that was my ultimate goal. Again, above, um, not only in the comment board, but in the description box is the direct link. Just go there, grab your pack. Um, like I said, they'll go fast. So as you can see, I, I divided them by the books. So um, you can kind of see Aren't they gorgeous? Ugh, like I said, I, I see a lot of people scanning. Um, there are so many beautiful. And yes, Selena can make more money um, if I wanted to do this individually. Um, but a daily deal wouldn't be a daily deal then. <laughs> Not only that, time is money, right? <laughs> and I really rather just throw it. Oh, that's right. That was that really cool reader. I have to go a little slower on this one. And I didn't rip the pages on this. I had taken the ties out of this book to give you guys as much as you can. That's why you see that. Those were, it was a tied in kind of book. I didn't want this to be a crazy long video. I just wanted to show you an idea. And you guys, as you can see, just run on over there. Might as well just run on over there and come back and watch it. <laughs> I'm telling you. Um, Oh, that was just to tell you, so that needs to go into that book. This goes with the book. Um, I wanted the person who ever got that book got the first page um, that gone with it. So it goes over there. And then the children's uh, music books that you've seen over there. It was, I think it's a ch children's music hour. Um, these are the pages you're going to get. Of course, these are not copied. These are original pieces. Of course, each pack is different, but again, I've made sure I got close as possible to what you'll be getting. This is from the shorthand dictionary book, but the book was really bad looking. So I just put that page in there so I remember to tell you that. That is the shorthand dictionary studies. And these are an example of the pages that you're going to get in it. It's pretty much about typing, how to do a telegram, how to do shorthand studies, like different typewriting um, letters and how to make a company letter, how to make a letter, and uh, some pictures and things like that. And the list goes on. Oops, this goes into the book. That goes in one of the books that you get. That is the one of the children's books, the the children's literature book. Oopsie. <laughs> I don't know what I got in there. Um, all right, so this here is from the children's literature book, and you get 10 pages. And wait to see what they look like. I'm so excited. This pack I was so excited for. 
Look how cute. Humpty Dumpty. Who's this? A oh, Lewis Carroll. That's Alice in a Wonderland. Shaking hands with Humpty Dumpty. I honestly did not do that on purpose. <laughs> so I didn't even realize that was it. Hey, what do you know? This is a cool pack. Um, like I said, they're just ripped randomly. Look how cute. This is a, a looks like a, a poem on mud. Look how cute. Tale of Peter Rabbit. Again, that was from the, the children's uh, literature book. There were stories after stories. It's like no matter which page I turn, they were absolutely like at animal crackers, guys. <laughs> oh, I love animal crackers. Especially the frosted ones. Okay, okay. I can just keep going and going, but I think you guys kind of get the idea. So this is a really cool pack that you get. This here becomes uh, one of the children's learning books. This one's phonics chart. How cool though, huh? Cannot go wrong. This is another Wonders of the World book. And these are the kind of pages you're going to be getting in it. And this is the smaller one and it is um, the older one. It has like that, um, what do you call that type of uh, ink? Ah. Oh my goodness. I My, my mind just went um, blank. <laughs> Look at monkey manners. That's a child for you. So you guys cannot go wrong. I'm so excited. It's interesting to see um, what the packs are like. All right, so the next two packs are, oopsie, this here goes into the book. Kind of came right out. And this goes into the book. The book copyright for the, uh, the 365 days um, stories for children. There's two books that I have ripped from. Um, the, from the 30s. That goes into the book. I did that to keep record of my notes because I knew I would lose my actual notes. You guys can have an idea. You could tell these are totally older. Look at that brownish. Oh, two raggedy and owls. This is Johnny told a story. So it looks like it goes by month by month, 365 days, and it tells stories. A story a day kind of thing. Oh, that is so cute. Meow, kitty cat. And then here's the second, 365 days. I think you get seven pages of each. So you get 14 pages. You cannot go wrong. That'd be good for Christmas. Look at that. Polly plays tug of war. Oh my God. Makes me want to have a child for a second. <laughs> All right. And I de I'm still going, guys. I'm still going strong. I haven't even got to the small ephemera pack. Um, or anything like that. But yeah, so that was a Whitman book. You know, there's a lot of times you see the Whitman playing cards or the Whitman um, um, flash cards and things. This is the giant book by Whitman, which is really cool. I need to put that in the book. So then I got pages from a vintage 50s mathematics sheet metal book. And that's what the cover of this is for. I'll just keep it in this pack, whoever gets this pack. Um, and then it had pages like this. I didn't even cut the edges. I just ripped it from the spiral. But look how cool though. You have to say that is pretty cool. And then I had a second um, dictionary, picture dictionary page books for children. And uh, I think you guys kind of got the idea. Good size pages to fold in half. And there's a whole lot. I think it's like 10 pages. I think in total, I think there's like 20 pages. Gosh, I could put that 20 page pack in my shop for like six, seven bucks. Um, but you guys are getting a great deal. So I hope you guys don't pass this up. Okay. So then you're going to get a thimmer pack here. That is just papers that are not going to be from book pages. I did put some flashcards in there as well. And you'll get a total of, this is just random. Look at the queen of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 10, 11 flashcards, uh, which these are great for tags and stuff like that. They're pretty good, thick flashcard feel. You'll get one of those small envelopes for, like say you're making a soft cover journal, um, some random papers that are children or retro garden uh, pages from one of the Wonders of the World book. You can't go wrong. You get a time card and then you'll get, oh, that's right a couple of the vintage uh, library Rolodex cards. You get two of those and then a vintage seed packet and then a vintage um, 
the uh, French seed labels and then the cigarette cards, which is so beautiful, don't you two think? I'm gonna keep that together because I still gotta do a photo shoot for the listing. Eek, that's always the hardest job for me is doing a photo shoot. I need to remember to keep that out. Oh, library card. And then the paper pack, oh my gosh. So you're gonna get a larger envelope that's like this. And then you're gonna get um, some ledger paper, a couple sheets of ledger. And then look at this greenish paper. And that's this one here. And then this one's a really large one. There we go. Which is nice. And then we have some type uh, typewriter lessons book pages. I only had two that will go in each. Pink and blue, which is really cute. Um, a folding uh, time card. It's a trifold you can put together and create something from. I had those in my shop. I sell them by like 10, 20, 30 packs or 40 packs. Then you'll get three pages of this Duneland. Um, it's like a uh, Chesterton, Indiana. I went to an estate sale in Chesterton and that's where this came. But it's like, um, looks like some children it says classroom, the age. Oh, if the incident, if the incident happened in school, nature of injury, it's like a record I figured why not it went with the theme right all right guys there you have it i'm excited i can't wait to guys grab this a box of goodies and free shipping um and um i have a surprise little like a little extra i'm putting in each pack and i'll give you an example of each whoever purchases them today um if they don't sell out today the price will go up and you won't get that extra free gift at all but I came across a bunch of rubber stamps. I, um, I went to a, a uh, online live sale and I'll link her information down below. And uh, she I bought a bunch of rubber stamps. Most of them are not used, but I'm just gonna randomly surprise each pack with a rubber stamp. Um, they're just all different. There's not one the same, some floral, some, you know, mostly not used. So can't beat it, right? So go ahead and grab your guys' daily deal. I'm thankful that you took the time to watch this. And I'm so glad I finally am back with some daily deals, guys. All right, guys, have a blessed one. Bye.